right, y'all, so I am making this recipe right here. It's for a drink, and I have my strawberries right here. We're about to cut those up. I have some evaporated milk, some sweetened condensed milk, and in a few of the videos I've seen, some people use vanilla extract, some people didn't. I got some sugar right here and some extra strawberries if I need them. But the name of the drink is called Agua Fresca, if I'm pronouncing that right. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, drop a comment. But I'm trying this drink, y'all, like I told y'all, because it's like a, to me, it seems like a nice little summer drink. But we're going to go ahead and get into the video. All right, y'all, so I already cut up my strawberries. So what I'm gonna do is just dice them up and cut, up, cut them into smaller pieces. And then I'm gonna leave big pieces to decorate like the cup with, and then also to have like chunks and stuff in it. So let's get into it. All right, so I already got my strawberries cut up, so I'm gonna go ahead and transfer them to the bowl, and then I'm gonna also add some water. All right, y'all, so now what I'm gonna do is add my water, and I don't have a blender. I did recently just give my older sister my blender because she moved into her house and she needed a couple things and it was brand new that i gave it to her still in the box i definitely will be buying me a new blender but i'm gonna use a fork so i'm about to go ahead and get to work and start smashing and we'll be back y'all don't get me wrong this is like kind of like the getaway but you gotta do what you gotta do with what you can. You feel me, honey? It's just still do the same thing. It just take longer. You feel me? But I'm just smashing the strawberries. It's actually, I got those smashed up. So I'm just gonna do that. All right, y'all. So I pretty much got my strawberries mashed up how I want it. I know um, in the video, they sifted it. So like the chunks and stuff, they took it out. But I'm gonna leave mine in because I don't think it's gonna hurt. When you drink it, you just might get chunks of strawberry. And I like stuff like that. said that if the condensed milk did not make um this sweet enough you could add sugar so that's when the sugar comes into play but i don't think i'm gonna add vanilla extract this time i think i'm gonna try that way <laughs> i think i'm gonna try that way next time y'all i'm adding a little bit of sugar y'all just in case and i'm gonna go ahead and start stirring it does taste good so far i just wanted a little bit of sweetness that's why i add the right, sugar it tastes so good just like how i want it she did say chill it for, well, put it in the refrigerator for about two hours, but I'm going to put it in the freezer for about 30 minutes to an hour, and it should be good. So after that, we'll be back. So I'm finished with my drink. Excuse the little mess in the background. I'm about to clean everything up, but this is what it's looking like. And I did put a little strawberry on top. So we're about to get Ma to taste test it. We're going to see what Ma thinks. Good. It's real good. Look, y'all. It's hitting. She likes it. Yeah, she really likes it. She says real good. Alright, y'all. So I got my second tester here. So tell me what you think. He wants to know what's in it, but I'm not telling him. I want him to just drink it. Yeah, try it. Tastes alright. 
I like strawberries though. Yeah. Oh my gosh, Jack. I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed the cook with me's and just the recipes, I do have another channel coming soon where I'm going to be cooking and also giving moms and anybody out there ideas on things to make for dinner on days where you feel like, hey, I'm tired of making the same thing or if you just you just really don't know what to make for dinner. So stay tuned for my channel y'all like i said comment like subscribe and if you are new thank you so much for watching i appreciate everybody but we are on the road to 1k holla at your girl